Welcome back. It is time now for another new edition of Taste of the Town. Chef Brad Kilgore is a James Beard Award finalist known for his creative outside the box dishes. Well, he has been pleasing palates of many South Florida foodies since he opened his first restaurant here about five years ago. Now, the celebrated chef has two new spots in the Miami Design District. CBS 4's Lisa Petrillo takes us to Kaido. Kaido in the Miami Design District is an Asian and Japanese inspired cocktail collaboration between award winning chef Brad Kilgore and master mixologist Nico DeSoto. It's been a few years just even working on the project, but I wanted to work with Nico DeSoto, my mixologist, and it's one of the best in the world. So I was just a fan of his, and now we get to have his cocktails. First, the cocktails. Here's Hato, a refreshing tequila drink with citrus, Japanese bamboo salt, and salted plums. Oh, wow. And the Shinobi, a milk punch that has over 20 ingredients it takes two days just to clarify. It really does. They're smooth and then there's sweet and then there's wow. The dining room is small and sexy. It's called Ama or Mermaid. The floor is sequined with plexiglass. But there's only one like it in the world. Kaido is the third South Florida restaurant for this well-respected celebrity chef. He recently opened a fourth, a grill named Embers, just below Kaido. I'm not Japanese, and uh, I'm not sushi trained, so we don't do sushi. Uh, the idea would be inspired by a lot of these things that you find in Japan, street food, cocktail bars. So the menu is actually supposed to be like when you're at a bar, you're hanging out, you just have drinks coming at you throughout the night, you know, bites coming at you throughout the night. Not your traditional appetizer entree dessert, more of a ultra lounge. Watching Kilgore in the kitchen is like watching an artist working on a canvas. It's where precision and design meet, as you see in this French-inspired beef tartare served inside mini cones. A little bit of spiciness, um, that's from the kimchi. And then the avocado mousse kind of cools it off at the end. It really does. It's like your favorite part of the cone, right? We play with an uni fondue, a warm velvety sauce of uni and aged parmesan, with an array of seafood, veggies, spices, and herbs. So much fun and interesting and delicious all in one. Next, enoki mushrooms. You don't see these mushrooms around too often, but I like them because they almost eat like a ramen noodle. We end on pineapple yuzu kakigori. It's topped off with Japanese shaved ice, and underneath is coconut cream, blueberries, cookies, and more. Just incredible. <gasps> Perfect for sharing. Four people get in on that. It's the best way to go. All right, Brad, I am not sharing anymore, but let's tell everybody how many days you're open here at Kaido. We're open Tuesday through Saturday, dinner only. All right, with a taste of the town that is fantastic here in the Design District, I'm Lisa Petrillo, CBS Foreign News. And Kaido is located in the Miami Design District at 151 Northeast 41st Street. And you have been there. Yes, How'd and you like it? As, as an Asian food expert, I would say <laughs> uh, it was very good. I loved uh, it, and I would go back. You were there with all your beautiful friends, yeah. weren't you? Oh, yeah. That's CBS 4 News at 5:30. Here's what's.